What's good everybody, it's your boy Jira, aka J-Rock, over here at motherfucking J-Rock Fitness. <laughs> and today's my first video I made in the new gym that I'm at now. And it's arm day, so let's get right into it. First I start out with wide grip curls. I do four sets of ten, and I only rest a minute between each set. I like to hit my inner head at a bicep starting out every arm day. Just because I think that's a lagging point for me. But yep, I did four sets. This is my fourth and final set. Again, I did 10 reps. You see my muscle connection. Squeezing the muscle that I'm using. Nice, slow, and controlled form. Alright y'all, go from my wide grip curls to cable curls with regular form. Just regular cable curls. I do three sets of this exercise, eight reps, because I'm doing a decent amount of weight. And I rest a minute and a half between each set also because I'm doing a decent amount of weight. But you see my almost connection, good form, squeezing the muscle that I'm working. This is my third and final set. Again, I did eight reps, three sets, and I rested a minute and a half between each set. You see I'm squeezing my bicep. Again, this is regular standard curl form. Curl form, excuse me. I started out doing a wide grip to hit the inner head, now I'm doing these. Alright y'all, now I'm doing reverse grip curls to hit the outer head of the bicep. I do four sets of this exercise, 10 reps, and I rest one minute between each set. My rest periods are going to change between each exercise that you see me do, because it all depends on how much weight I'm doing. Right now I'm cutting, I'm on a leading out process, so I've actually lost about 10 pounds, I was 240, so what you're looking at right now is 230 pounds trying to get down to 220 pounds. It all depends on how ripped that look. But anyways, yes. My sets, my rest periods are gonna change between each ex exercise. It all depends on what I'm doing. But anyways, this is my fourth and final set. Again, I rested a minute between each set and I did reps of 10. See my almost connection, squeezing the muscles that I'm working, which is the outer head of the bicep. Alright y'all, now you're going to see me do tricep push downs. My triceps are good, but I want to start making them bigger, so I'm doing four sets of this exercise. I'm doing the whole fucking stack, therefore I'm resting two minutes between each set. You see my muscle connection, squeezing those triceps, nice slow controlled forward. Right, y'all, this is my fourth and final set. Again, I did 10 reps. Four sets, rested two minutes between each set. You might see me look at the camera a couple times. That's only because I can see myself in the camera. I can kind of see how my form looks, that's all. So if I'm creeping you out, I apologize. <laughs> nice, slow control form, squeezing them damn triceps. And I'm showing y'all right here that I'm stacking this bitch. Just for y'all who think I might be weak, that is not the case. Your boy does go hard in the gym, and he does do a lot of weight. Stacking that bitch. Now right y'all know I'm gonna start doing heavy dips. I haven't done these in a while, so I'm gonna make these a regular routine. I do do them on the bench, but I don't do it with the heavy dip machine. So you're gonna see me do these a lot now. I need three sets of this exercise, eight reps, and I rest two minutes between each set. This is kind of like a heavy, heavy movement, so I rest two minutes. All right, this is my third and final set. Again, I do eight reps, three sets, and I rest two minutes between each set. Nice slow control form. I'm not going too far down, because if you go too far down, you're going to end up snapping your fucking shoulders apart. So, you don't want that. 
Make sure you stay comfortable doing your exercises. Stay comfortable. Or you will get hurt. If it feels weird, stop doing it. You're doing something wrong. Alright, y'all. Go from those straight to these tricep push downs. I like this machine right here. This machine's pretty neat. Kind of mimics the uh, uh, heavy dip. Kind of mim mimics doing heavy dips. I do 12 reps of this exercise. I do three sets. And the only rest is 30 seconds between these sets. Because this is just burning out my triceps. I'm using this just to burn myself out. Burn them triceps out. This is my third and final set. And like I said again, I rest 30 seconds and I'm just trying to burn out my damn triceps. I'm doing 12 reps. Alright y'all. After that, I decided to burn up my biceps some more. So I'm doing incline, concentration curls, slash hammer curls, concentration hammer curls. I love doing this exercise. It's how you build a nice, big, fat peak, nice bicep peak. And it also, well, just period, this helps you build a nice bicep peak. As you see, your boy's making some gains. He's leaning out, like I said. I've lost 10 pounds. So you see that damn bicep starting to pop, starting to come out. I do two sets of this exercise, and I only rest a minute between each set. And you're gonna see me switch it in a minute. I start out doing concentration curls, sets of eight, everything with sets of eight, when it comes to this. I started doing concentration curls, and then you're gonna see me switch right off the bat and start doing hammer curls, concentration hammer curls. Again, nice slow control form, my muscle connection, squeezing those biceps, squeezing the muscle that I'm using. You gotta squeeze. If you do proper form, you're focusing on building that muscle. That's the best way to make gains, period. Now switch arms, do my last set of eight. Again, y'all do two sets of exercise, eight reps, rest in a minute between each set. And that's it, y'all. I'm going to have a whole lot more videos coming soon, different workouts, my cutting, everything going on. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe, baby. J-Rock motherfucking fitness. Like and subscribe.